All right, folks, buckle up. I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about BlackRock in about two minutes without it being boring or gay. Let's go. Don't know who BlackRock is? That's fine, you're not alone. They're kind of one of these shadowy behind the scenes entities that only really gets mentioned in conspiracy circles. But BlackRock's not just a theory, they're real and they're massive. BlackRock controls $10 trillion in assets, which is larger than the GDP of every country on earth, except for the US and China. So let's break down what BlackRock does. They're the largest asset manager in the world. That means they have stakes in pretty much everything. Corporations, governments, real estate. They're so powerful, in fact, people argue that BlackRock is probably more influential than the governments themselves. And with their ESG policies, they're reshaping how business is done. Sounds cool, right? Well, let's see just how deep their influence goes. Now here's where it starts getting shady. BlackRock's been buying up single family homes, driving up the housing prices, and making it near impossible for regular folks like you and I to buy a house. They're essentially playing Monopoly with real properties, turning the housing market into a playground for the rich while the rest of us are stuck renting forever. And here's the kicker. An alleged shooter in one of the assassination attempts on Trump was actually featured in a BlackRock commercial. Now, I'm not saying BlackRock's directly involved here, but what I am saying is, how is it that one of the most influential, powerful, secretive companies on Earth, with more power than most governments, has a commercial featuring a person that's involved in one of the most high-profile crimes in recent history? Coincidence? Maybe, but maybe not. So congratulations, now you know who BlackRock is and who's probably influencing more facets in your daily life than any other worldly entity. Share this video with someone you care about. Either way, everything is gay.